Hebrews 13, so uh, verse 12, so Jesus also suffered outside the gate in order to sanctify the people through his own blood. Therefore, let us go to him outside the camp and bear the reproach he endured. I love that one. I can't just read that one. I can read some of the other ones. This one I just love. Because he says, you know, Jesus suffered outside the gate. You remember, remember when, when, when Jesus, they, they, they wouldn't crucify him inside the city. Why? They had to take him outside the city because that's where they took the trash out. That's where they burned the trash. That's where everything unclean went. That's where all the reject. You're, you're not allowed in our city. We're going to crucify you out there. Okay, the same place where we dump all the trash. Okay, and we're going to crucify you with a couple of losers, some criminals. That's, that's where you belong. And, 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 and so, so he's out there, and you see what the writer of Hebrews is saying? He goes, man, you understand? Man, all these people in the city, they're going, man, Jesus isn't good enough. We don't want him in here. And if he suffered out there, he goes, man, if that's my Jesus, then fine. I'll get out of the city. I'm going to go out to where the cross is. Because, man, if you're going to reject my Jesus, then take me with him. It's like, wow. It's just a sense of, you're going to do that to Jesus? I'm not going to stay here comfortably in the city and try to be accepted by you all. I'm going to go out to where he is. I'll suffer outside the gate. Okay, call me an idiot. Call me a freak. You know, tell me I'm screwing everything up. Reject me. I want to be like Jesus. I want to go to wherever he is. James 5 is an example of suffering. You get the idea. Every book of the New Testament Suffering, suffering, suffering. And yet we're surprised. We're surprised when the trials come, like something weird's happening. Why am I suffering? Because if you're not suffering, you shouldn't be at peace. You, you should be wondering, man, what, what in the world? How come no one's attacking me? How come Satan's not attacking me? Because he didn't have to. 